Hi, good morning. Uh, my name is Mark. I'm making a tutorial about uh, how to make a pictures look nice. Um, <coughs> para po to sa mga kaibigan ko din at family. Um, to those who interested na gawin ang uh, yung picture nila mas uh, maganda tingnan. Um, sample po lang to ito ng picture ni Emma Watson. Um, Um, may mga problem po siya dito sa mga skin niya tapos yung pixel niya okay maganda yung pixel niya um, uh, we're going to try this picture uh, to look nice okay we're going to close this one before we're going to edit this one we're going to resize it so this is a <coughs> this is a 1920 uh, uh, by 120 So we're going to resize this without a picture damage, uh, uh, without damaging the picture. So I'm going to use a <coughs> image uh, image uh, converter. So I'm um, using the image converter class. Um, going to add operation resize. Um, going to just change this to 800 by maybe 500. After ma after start, um, this is the result. So the result is 800 by 500, and then the pictures is resize, and then the pixel is not damaged. So this is the 800 by 500 pixel, and then we're going to. picture look nice so we're going to I'm using After Effects CS4 so we're going to add a file so import file file um, we're going to find our uh, Emma Watson here um, we're going to use this one uh, at end by clicking on the <coughs> by clicking by clicking the picture we're going to drag to make here to make a new composition in my After Effects so I'm going to press this one by the way this is a video editing program um, but we're going to use this as picture so we're going to this is a, a new editing style or editing way in the picture by using the video so <coughs> um, and then next uh, we're going to duplicate the pictures of Emma so by clicking here the layer first layer we're going to control D um, this is the first layer and then the second layer so in the first layer we're going to add a, a effect so we're going to type here a CC threshold CC threshold We're going to find the CC threshold RGB. Yes, this one. So double click. I'm going to make this the white into red, and then the other is are black. So we're going to boost up the green, and then we're going to boost up the blue, and then we're going to adjust. maybe 140 140 140 okay then we're going to add another effect oh color correction use color correction by the way marami po dyang editing software ng picture but maganda po yung After Effects para sa akin. So I'm using also a Photoshop. But Photoshop using the healing brushes. So um, make a lot of job. So we're going to make the, the gray into white. So by boosting the by using the effects. By using the effects. 
um, effects, effects, color correction, level. This is the level, so we're going to this is this one, nice. And then we're going to add another layer. We're going to put another layer between these two layer. Okay, we're going to make a layer by clicking layer, new, adjustment layer. the adjustment layer between those two so we're going to add an effect uh, we're going to first we're going to make a tra uh, track map so we're clicking uh, track map uh, alpha map we're going to choose the alpha map so alpha map uh, we're going to look our picture uh, there's no improvement why? Uh, we're going to add another effects in the adjustment layer. So by clicking the adjust layer, we're going to effect. Uh, uh, the noise? noise and grain. This is the effects that we made um, um, without uh, any adjustments. Uh, there's there's uh, there's already a result. Um, the face of Emma Watson's are healed. All the bad pixels and the bad skins are healed. Um, we're going to preview this one into final output. Sorry for my computer because I'm using a video recorder and while making an effects that my computer cannot cope the memory RAM. So that's why we're too slow. So this is our final output. We're going to preview by We have our uh, beautiful face here of Emma Watson. Uh, we're going to make a adjustment. Okay. Um, the sizes of the pixels, the sizes of noise, maybe it's okay. And we're going to add a grain. So to make the pictures look original, so we're going to add a grain. <coughs> so we go by clicking the adjustment layer, no effect. Uh, noise and grain, add grain. Okay, going to preview this in full. Load the same. Are you? Change the intensity to 150, I think 150. Uh, 0.150. Okay. <coughs> Maybe my RAM is too. Problema po tayo sa RAM natin, ng computer po natin, kasi low spec lang po yung computer ko. Uh, okay, we have here our final output. Uh, we put a grain, grain in your face, so we're going to change another to 1.70, maybe 1.80. If you have a supercomputer, you can make this effect uh, faster. Okay? Mabilis lang po yung effects na to. Um, pag meron po kayo yung mga supercomputer dyan na quad-core, um, 
iyo nga akin is luwal pa lang po Atensyon na po um, Maybe this year I'm going to upgrade this one So I have here um, I have a perfect frame here So we're going to Another make a adjustment color uh, Effect We're going to effect here Flash scene So we're going to add another effect So we're going to another layer mm, New adjustment layer so the adjustment layer is in the first, in the top, and then the first layer is the alpha man. I know the, the third layer is the alpha man with the adjustment layer, and the second layer is our effects, the one that made the nice picture here, and this the last layer is the original picture without the effects or any adjustment. So we're by clicking the adjustment layer in the first layer in the top. I'm going to make an effects color correction. Um, this is by adjusting the colors. I'd like to use the corp. This is my favorite, the corp effect. So we're going to adjust the contrast here. Um, contrast here, maybe like the green. Not the perfect. Perfect already. Um, like pink here. So we're going to adjust the to boost up and then add a contrast here effects of After Effects, this is the the hardest part of uh, rendering a preview then with, with your computer it's not a high quality computer so this is a, the final output here uh, we're going to render this one we're not going to render this into a video because this is a video program here we're going to render this is a, as a picture. So how to render in the After Effects like a picture? So we're going to um, uh, composition. Uh, not add a render queue. Uh, save frame as file. Yes. All the pi all the pi all the pi all the video had a frame. So we're going to uh, save frame as file. So we're going to not a photoshop by clicking on photoshop here we're going to make a jpeg, JPEG, JPEG sequence so we're going to change it to the format it's up in an ok ok and then the output and the output here I know it's in, we're going to click here and we put in the desktop so we're going to going to render this okay okay you heard the sound and after effects after you finish to render after the finish rendered you heard uh, the magic sound so we're going to find our project here. I have here, um, I have here a two picture here. This is a not edited picture of Emma Watson. Okay, and then this one is edited. So where's the nice pictures that? here one and two so 
maybe you choose what you like you like this in your facebook or you like this in your facebook so imagine if you're doing this to all of your pictures Okay, I hope you learn something about uh, learn something of my tutorial here and to all of my family and friends. I would like to make a uh, picture editing using my the program of video editing. <laughs> so subscribe and I will send you another tutorial. Um, uh, this is Marco Fifty Nine Five. Thank you for watching. Uh, good day.